This is going to be a little brief overview of the new Android operating system O, which I believe is Oreo, but anyway, uh, they're still rolling out Nougat, but uh, this is the uh, preview of the new O, so this is the beta version. Uh, this is going to be running on my Nexus player, which I really don't use that often, but anyway, yeah, kids at home, don't try this at home because it's not very good at this point in time. So anyway, what I want to do is just show you the uh, graphical user interface, the GUI or GUI they call it. Um, again, I'm using my Nexus player. And the build, now if you notice the last three digits, 0.019. I believe that indicates when they uh, just pushed this one out, which uh, two days ago. Uh, I was going to make this uh, video a couple days ago, but anyway, I got busy. My router died on me, so I had to buy a new router and set that all up. But anyway, uh, this is what it's all about. Okay, you got live channels. Now, it's only got six, six of these little thumbnails that's on there. Now, you can go to apps, and this is where you uh, set up those... Uh, the ones you want to display. In live channels, this is the previews. Uh, MB, There's quite a few there. Works very well. Oh, and if I want to move MB up or down, click that one. And you can move it wherever you want to display it. Okay, so you got MB, you got YouTube. Looks like you got some white spots there, titles, uh, SPMC. Again, that fills in quite a few of them. And XB, uh, Plex, excuse me, Plex. Now that one, for whatever reason, I cannot get it to fill in. I can get it here. But anyway, uh, so they've got a little bit to do on the Plex part of it. So again, that, uh, that one doesn't work. Uh, SPMC, music. Now one thing that I do want to show you too on live channels, the, uh, the picture quality is not that great. Don't know why. I don't know if it's because of this beta O or it's just the fact that uh, the quality is not that good. Um, but some of the SD channels, the standard definition, they got like they call mice, mice teeth. If you notice around the edges of the, uh, the person or whatever, little, little uh, jaggeds all the way around it. Uh, again, I'm, I think this appeared on the other ones prior to the uh, O, and that's probably one of the reasons I really don't use the uh, Nexus player, because the quality is not that great. And again, HD Home Run. As usual, it plays well. Again, it's got the little uh, mice teeth also. So that's something inherent of this device itself. So, but I do have many, many different devices. So my better ones are the little $40 ones running uh, Libra ELAC and the picture quality is just outstanding on those. So anyway, um, takes a minute to get out of that one. Like it's hung up a little bit. Okay, there we go. And MB. Now let's see what on my uh, my AV receiver. Now this is a Blu-ray rip that has the HD audio, high definition audio. 
but I don't think that this box, uh, my uh, Nexus player, I don't think it supports the uh, high definition audio. Uh, it's also it's kind of slow, obviously, uh, uh, grabbing that uh, video and displaying it. But again, some of it may do the fact that I had to replace my uh, router yesterday and I had to reboot everything. So anyway, that one is a no-go. So anyway, uh, it's not working very well for the Nexus player. So anyway, uh, that's what I want to do. I just want to give you an overview of what the uh, GUI GUI looks like, graphical user interface. So that's it. And nothing here. I, so anyway, that's what I wanted to show you. And uh, it's not for everyday use. It is still a beta version. Okay, thank you.